taking two rectangles of fabric that measure eight inches wide by six inches down. One's for your lining and one's for your outer. You're gonna fold both of them lengthways right sides together. For your outer, you're gonna sew down both of the short sides. For your lining, you're gonna sew down one of the short side and about a quarter of the way down from the top edge, leaving the bottom three quarters unstitched. Trim back your seam allowances on your outer piece by half and then turn this one in the right way. Once this one is turned in the right way, you can slip it inside your lining so that it's going to be right sides together. In it goes, push it down, and you're gonna line up those side seams so they are nice and neatly touching right sides together. You can open up your seam allowances and pop a clip on there. Pop a clip on the seam allowance and then do the same on the other side, the other end. And then you're going to clip all the way around the top edge. Once you've clipped all the way around that top edge, you are going to sew all the way around the top edge using a edge of a presser foot seam allowance. So once you've sewn all the way around the top edge, you can use your little opening in your lining to turn it all in the right way. Once you've turned it all in the right way, you've got a little opening. You're gonna just turn your raw edges to the inside, press that, and then stitch it closed, very close to the edge. Once you've stitched up your hole in the side, you can then turn this lining down inside your outer. Push it down into the corners and press all around the top edge. Once you've pressed your edges, you're going to measure down from the top edge three quarters of an inch and in from the right hand edge by an inch and a half and make a mark with a removable pen. This is when we're going to add some cam snaps. Now if you don't have these, you can just use poppers and stitch them in place. But you need these markings that we've made on either side. So we've got an inch and a half in and an inch down and an inch and a half in and an inch down. And then you're going to take an awl if you're adding cam snaps and stab through both sides of your holder with the awl. If you're not using an awl, then you're going to be stitching poppers to the other side. So you're going to want to pop a pin through your marking and transfer the marking onto the other side so you can see where to sew your popper. So you'll want a male and a female so that they pop together. But we're gonna add cam snaps. So I'm gonna use my awl and stab all the way through. For each side, you're going to want to have what I like to call the drawing pin and a male and a drawing pin and a female. For our left hand side, and you're gonna need a male and a female and two drawing pins for the right hand side. So we'll start by inserting the males. So we're gonna take our drawing pin and we're gonna pop it through the hole just from the top of our fabric through to the inside. So I've pushed my drawing pin through so that the flat part is on my outside and you can see the little spike through on the inside and you can see your hole here on the opposite side um, ready to put our female on. So I'm now going to take the male and slide it over this little point. So you can see that's just pushed on. I've pushed it into place and it will hold a little bit in place. You're then going to want to take your fixer, your cam snap fixer, and you're going to sit the flat of your drawing pin into this little black cup here. Make sure that it's sitting properly in its little cup and that it will slide around and you can then squeeze the trigger to squash it. So you can see I'm gonna take my squeezer and I'm gonna sit my flat of my cam snap into that little cup. You want to be able to move it around and then you're going to squeeze it hard. So once you've squeezed your male into place, you're gonna put another male on this side here. And then obviously you want a female component on the opposite two sides.
So there you have it, one finished little DPN holder and it's got its male and its female to clip together. Ta-da! Like so.